Hi there, Cosmo family. My name is Yelia in this incarnation, and the message of today is linked with the square between Mars and Leo and Uranus in Taurus. I talked about this yesterday, but uh, this aspect is going to last until the first days of July, which is now. And not only that, um, Venus, I, I, in another video, I explained how important it was to pay attention to the period between June 19th until July 23rd, uh, because this is the period that Venus is um, traveling through the mathematical degrees that it's going to review in its retrogradation then. So Venus is going to repeat this square with Uranus three times. The first one is July 2nd. The, the second one is in August, in the first days of August. And the third one is in the last part of September. And not only that, uh, Mercury in Leo is going to do a square with Uranus in Taurus in uh, the, the final part of July. So I think it's very important. Uh, yesterday, yesterday I was um, telling how uh, this square is a tension and is something that is pushing us to move ourselves from a place to break with something, to break with a mold or maybe um, with an identification of our, of our ego. Maybe it's a relationship, maybe it's a job, maybe it's something that is related to the material plane because... Um, is something that is preventing us to express ourselves the way we are right now uh, because this, these things have no resonance anymore with us. So it's very important to understand how um, this energy of Leo is linked with the inner child and could many times express itself as a demand on the outside when we are not feeling recognized, when we are not feeling seen, or um, when we are taking everything Personal. This is very important because uh, when we have this inner child that it's not integrated, um, we could feel that everything is personal. And we live in a world with many people with different processes, with different um, e evolutionary times. So uh, many times people could act in ways that are not linked with uh, how uh, we are behaving with, our, with them. So... <clears throat> It's very important to pay attention to this and to not involve ourselves and to because we we cannot not be responsible for the the behaviors of others, but we can choose to not react to that and to not put um to not not put our energy in a conflict that is in a discussion that is not going to bring anything good for anyone anyone. <laughs> And of course, to recognize our own wounds in order to integrate them and to develop the intention of getting better every time. I mean, uh, it doesn't matter if we acted in an incoherence um, in incoherence with our higher dimensions of our soul, but it's important that to understand that that has consequences and um, to understand that life is going to give us many, many opportunities to, to do this because uh, it's going to repeat the scene once and again in order for us to integrate that experience. So it doesn't matter <laughs> if we didn't that uh, in, in the correct way for our soul. But today I wanted to talk about uh, dignity because dignity is something that nobody can give us. Dignity is a sense that we are having when we really uh, are respecting ourselves, when we are saying no to things that are not aligned with us and we are saying yes to things that have resonance with our essence. So um, it's very important because many times we have wounds and programmations that uh, that makes us get attached to per to people, places, spaces that are not feeling, nor not bringing ourselves this feeling of dignity, of feeling worthy, and we uh, don't misunderstand me. Every one of us, we are worthy of love, but many times we believe we we are not. So it's very important to understand this in order to not put energy in things that are not aligned to ourselves, that are not bringing good, that are not bringing healthy love, you know, um, with this square between Venus and, and Uranus. If I am putting energy, for example, in a person, I, I met a person and that person is not interested suddenly because <clears throat> Uranus is a lot of about this energy of um, unexpected 
And uh, if that person is not showing interest, then I retire my energy and I put it in myself. Then uh, I will find someday someone that is aligned with with uh, what I want. So it's very important to, to understand that everything that is being reflected right now is linked to our own wounds and uh, we have the chance to, to heal them. It's all about that. Uh, it's not about we are not worthy. It's about taking this dignity and this self-respect to choose what really brings um, healthy things for ourselves. So um, it's important to, to use this energy to make decisions and to not stay in places that are not aligned with who we are anymore. So thank you, uh, family. I will leave the video here. See you in the next one. Ciao, ciao.